Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Varteta Learning Platform and today we are going to discuss about this assignment operator and the conditional operator in TypeScript. So this will be a very small video and I think you are all aware about these operators as well. So if you want to skip this video, you can skip. But yes, if you want to stay and if you want to revise the things, you can do that. So for the assignment operators, these are the operators like equal to operator, plus equal to, minus equal to, division equal to, remainder equal to, and multiplication equal to. Okay, so uh, let me just give you an example. You know about this equal to operator. But what about this plus equal to operator? When we talk about the plus equal to, which means a is equal to a plus b, here the example has been given, right? So if you write something like uh, uh, where a number is equal to 3 or 2, and then if you write like a plus equal to 3, and then you console, then you print like console.log, and then you write something like a then and if you run it let me just call this function here okay now when we call assignment operator function here i have already opened the power cell here so let me just go to the git bash so that i can easily run it and let me just see what is the current directory path okay so my current directory path should be like c vikas and then cd space what is the name of this file typescript no cd dot dot i think i have placed it outside the yes outside the vikas so here i can just try to run it and to run it first we need to compile it so typescript compiler and then typescript.ts it will convert it into the .js file as everything is fine now using the node command you can run this and if you run this you find it a plus equal to 3 means a is equal to a plus 3 which means 5 so here it was printed as 5. So I hope this is very clear to you and there is nothing like you know about this operator. This is the remainder operator. When you divide uh, B by A, then whatever remainder will be there that will be assigned to A. Okay. So here everything has been explained like what is the meaning of minus equal to plus equal to. So I have just given one example related to plus equal to and rest of the things you can take care of yourself. And the other one is the conditional operator. This is also you are aware of. Okay, so here I have taken one variable which is having the value 10 and uh, then I have taken a value b which is uh, of type boolean and here I am comparing the value a with 10. So what does this mean if a is equal to 10? So here we are comparing it which means that if a is equal to 10 then in that case I will assign true to it and if this is not 10 then I will assign false to it. Okay, so based on that, uh, we can make the decision while we write the program, right? Based on the based on some of the values, and uh, here if we write like uh, triple equals, you know about the triple equals, that will be the best practice here. In case you don't know what is the type of a, and if you don't declare the type of a, then in that case, this is the good practice if you want to compare it with a real integer. In that case, you need to follow this. Okay, so this I have already explained, so you can uh, relate that one. So let me just show you the demo of this con conditional operator. So let me just call it here. And let me just uh, sign this line. And then let me just run it. So what do you think what will be assigned here? It will be, since it's equal to 10, which is you know it is equal to 10 so this will be assigned like true here so if i run it then true comes okay so this is how the conditional operators and the assignment operators works and this was a very small uh, topic and you already are aware of if you have ever worked on the programming language like c c plus plus whatever uh, in your college days you have uh, learned then these things could have been uh, you know taught to you there Okay, so with this, I 
just uh, end this video and please uh, like subscribe my channel and uh, share this video with uh, your friends whosoever are in the earlier learning stages because this video uh, just to cover that every topic I need to cover I have just uh, covered this topic but I know that these things are known to you most of uh, the people uh, among you must be aware about these things okay so have a nice day and bye bye